Hi YouTube, this is a quick video to uh, let everyone know how you can add NaviX and other add-ons onto your Apple TV too. So what I'm going to do first is we're going to pull out CyberDuck. If you don't have that, install it and, <clears throat> and it, after that you want to open it up and you want to go to first you want to go and open connection and go to SFTP SSH file transfer protocol type in your IP address of your Apple TV type in root for the username and alpine is the default password I recommend you change it I'll be making a video soon to show you how to change it now once you're connected you go in you go first here and then you go back to this to the very first thing and then you go to private var and you go down to mobile and the very first one applications that's where you drop your NaviX zip file it's that easy when you're finished it'll be right there just as mine is as you can see NaviX zip folder is right there so this was just a quick video I just wanted to show you guys how to add NaviX zip folder onto your Apple TV 2 so I'll be making another video showing you how to add a uh, repos and such because it goes to a different part so I'll show you next time.